happening now? Controversy at the Democratic National Convention. Georgia Congressman Hank Johnson under fire for using the word termites when referring to Israeli settlers moving into Palestinian territories. And Channel 2's Craig Lizzie live in Philadelphia. This has gotten so much attention, Craig, and you talk to him. Let's hear about this apology. It really has gotten a lot of attention, Justin, and when I spoke with him, he told me that he wanted to clarify his words, and he's sorry that he offended anybody by his comments. Now, of course, Republicans wanted to weigh in on this, so we went to their news conference across town and spoke to a local Republican from Hall County. Can you clear this up? Yeah, I can. I did not refer to Jewish settlers as termites. I referred to the settlement activity or the process of settlements like termites, eating away at the peace process, making uh, it almost impossible to achieve a two-state solution. Georgia Congressman Hank Johnson told me he wants to set the record straight after he made controversial comments at an event sponsored by an anti-Israel organization in Philadelphia. He says this headline from the Washington Free Beacon is inaccurate. Are you saying that your words were taken out of context? No, I'm saying that the title of the article, which everyone is reacting to, is a misstatement of what I said. During this RNC at the DNC news conference where they set up rigged games because they have repeatedly said the political system is rigged, Republican Ashley Bell of Hall County, Georgia, said this about Representative Johnson. Using the word termite at all, I think is something that I think Congressman Johnson should rethink that, that the word in, in itself. No one lives peacefully alongside termites. When people think of termites, they think of something that needs to be exterminated. I want to apologize to all of my Jewish friends and supporters who were offended, and anyone else who may have been offended by that inappropriate um, analogy. Representative Johnson went on to say, quote, I stand by the substance of what I said. Also today, we spoke with former Senator, Georgia Senator Jason Carter. My colleague, Jovita Moore, just landed here in Philadelphia. She will have his words about unity tonight. Also, the role that his grandfather will be playing here at the Wells Fargo Center for this very large crowd. We're live at the Democratic National Convention in Philadelphia. Craig Lucy, Channel 2 Action News.